Welcome back guys, General Tony here, coming back with a brand new episode for you here today. Now I have barely had any sleep and I'm pretty much just running on adrenaline so I do apologize if I sound a little bit loopy or a little bit crazy inside of this episode but a miracle has happened, an absolute miracle has happened and inside of the current war, check this out guys, this is unbelievable. Look at that, they're just giving us a free victory, this guy, this team has just decided to put most of their bases to like easy three-star troll bases. It's just completely weird. But you know what? It's 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 okay. We get a free win basically, and we can uh, get quite a lot of loot. So if we actually go into the war details, if we go into the enemy team, they've basically just said, "War opponents, you win. All we want is your number one and number two bases, the town hall, and the storage is on the outside." So obviously these are just like a looting clan, just trying to get a little bit of loot. So what we're gonna do? Inside of this episode, it's going to be absolutely amazing. We are going to do both of our attacks alive. I've got a feeling I'm going to fail because I just absolutely suck. But what we're going to do, this guy's base says my hero vs yours. So he's got his king and his queen inside of there, but we also have the Grand Warden. So should we cheat and use the Grand Warden as well? Uh, maybe, maybe we'll see what happens. Obviously, first thing we need to do, because our queen is upgrading, is actually gem the queen. So the queen is going to cost us 624 gems. Now we don't have that, so we're going to go into the treasury. And we're going to buy ourselves a bag of gems. So we just got a bag of gems. Hopefully that worked. Please say I have enough dollars in the account. Is it going to work? Yep, there we go, guys. So we've just got ourselves 1,200 gems. So now we're going to gem the queen. 624 gems later. And she is level 23. Just two levels off of level 25. And of course, the king is level 25. Why did I not boost you? I completely forgot. Okay, so to start it off, this is what we're going to do. We are going to be using just a standard, pretty much, go wipe and a couple of giants against that number one base. I'm hoping we're going to be able to beat it because if we don't, oh man, that's going to be embarrassing. And then we're going to attack number two straight after and we're going to use all bowlers. It's going to be all bowlers. Are we going to be able to triple star for the first time ever inside a war using all bowlers against this extremely hard base? Check those Inferno Towers, definitely he's placed them in an awkward position on purpose. But all of those buildings are going to be easy to take and all of the defenses are grouped up together. So it should be some real fun in this episode. So let's just kick this off. We are about to go right deep inside of number one. We got the two golems, 18 wizards, 10 giants, one pecker. The queen is ready, of course. Let's gem our heroes. Here we go, guys. Gemmed. And let's gem the king as well. First, let's boost him so he's going to be a lot bit cheaper when we come around to gem him again. Let's just boost all of the heroes. May as well, may as well. So there we go, guys. So he boosted the heroes. And now we are ready to attack inside a wall. I'm actually nervous. I'm literally nervous to do this. Because if I fail, this is going to be live. And I'm just going to completely suck. So let's go in for the attack, guys. Here we go. Boom. I literally feel, feel kind of sick. Because I, I know I'm going to fail. So we're going to drop down a minion just to take out that expo. No, go away, silly air sweeper. And then we're also going to want to take out that Eagle Artillery, of course. So we're going to drop down what we're going to do. Four Giants there. And we're going to go with the Wizards just to take out the Eagle Artillery. Oh, we also get the Grand Warden as well, which is okay. So that takes them all out. And then we can just drop down some of these minions over here. We're going to keep a couple of them just in case. And now it's time to do the Hero Challenge. Here we go. Let's test if he's got a big bomb inside. Yes, he tricked me. He tricked me, the cheeky bugger. See that, guys? That's what you call a sly player. Look at that. So he's got his little bloody skeletons going all over the place. What an absolute little cheat he is. So here we go, guys. We are going to do the hero versus hero challenge. But before we do, we're going to drop in the golem. Go in with some of those. In fact, no. Look at this. We're going to go hero, hero. Going to drop in the rage spell. Here we go. Come on, then, heroes. Come and get some. Tony's about to wipe you out. There it is, guys. And yeah, let's just go in for the attack now. Gonna drop in Golem. Gonna go in with a second Golem. Gonna go in with the uh, the Wizards. And we're gonna try and clean up this base now. Let's just do it. It's gonna be fun. Let's go in with the Grand Warden there. We'll drop a Rage Spell just up ahead. And we'll keep the Pekka. We're gonna keep the Pekka for up here. Gonna drop in a free spell very shortly. Let's drop the first free spell there. Yeah, that free spell was a complete waste. So we're gonna drop down the second free spell. Go in with a Pekka. Come on, troops, make your way deep into the base. Let's do some damage to this. Let's take it out. Oh, my God, there's only a minute and something seconds left. We're going to be able to take out that second multi-target Inferno Tower. Where did my minion go? Didn't my minion kill that? thought the minion would have killed that, but it doesn't matter. The troops are, uh, yeah, they're getting destroyed here. Not really doing too great, but where's the queen? Queen, 
Oh, the queen's doing a job up the top. So this guy was definitely one of those sly players. I knew there were going to be traps inside of there. And there was. Let's just drop the archers up there. There's no point keeping them back. And yeah, we've got the triple star, hopefully. Definitely one of the most sly troll bases I've ever seen. So the golems are making their way up towards the top. The little Harry Potters are doing some damage to the defenses. Is Tony going to get the triple star? He uses the queen's ability just in time. And there it is. It is the perfect three star. And we also killed his heroes. So now that we got number one out of the way, it is time to go in and attack number two live, guys. As I said, we're going to be using the 30 bowler attack strategy. I don't really care if I fail. This is just for fun, guys. This is literally just for fun. So what we're going to do, we are going to gem ourselves. We're going to go for, we're going to go for some healers. You know what? Are they, uh, are they single target Inferno Towers? I can't remember. Let's just check. They were. Yes, they are. They're single target Inferno Towers, which means we're going to go for some... Should we go for healers or just all bowlers? We'll go for all bowlers. So we're gonna uh, we're gonna we're gonna gem ourselves some bowlers. Come here, guys. Come here, little little beautiful bowlers. So these little uh, little orange, not orange, sorry, purple bowlers. We're gonna bring. How many should we go for? Oh, we can't max out. Have we got some troops inside of our camp? Yeah, we got a wall breaker. Let's dump that wall breaker, and then we can literally bring thirty bowlers. Thirty bowlers. It's gonna be absolutely insane. If I fail this, it's going to be a little bit embarrassing. In fact, this may be more embarrassing than the first one. But there we go. We've got a total of 30 maxed out bowlers, guys. This is going to be awesome. And then what we're going to do, we are going to gem ourselves. We're going to go for two rage spells, two free spells. Why is it not that? Oh, we've got earthquakes in our camp. Damn. All right, we're going to drop out. We're going to drop out a free spell. And we're going to go for a heal spell instead. So a heal spell, free spell, and two rage spells. Let's gem them all up there. Let's see if we can get ourselves a golem. Hopefully we can get ourselves a single golem inside of the actual clan castle there. And we're ready to go. So we requested giants instead, guys. Just trying to fill the CC as soon as possible, to be honest with you. And what we're going to do now, we are going to... Have we got, we got full CC yet? We've got a full CC, six level... Uh, sorry, seven level six giants. We're going to gem the king. There we go, and now we are completely ready. Go away, George. We are completely ready to go in, guys. We've got 30 bowlers, 7 giants, 1 uh, one earthquake, 3 more earthquakes, 1 heal, 2 rage spells, 1 free spell, and of course, the triple heroes. So let's just go ahead and scout the base first. Now, if you've made it this far into the episode, this is what I want you to do, because this is going to be very interesting. If you think I'm going to three-star this base, then smash your like down below. And if you think I'm going to fail... Comment in the comment section, hashtag Tony sucks. You've got to do one or the other. Do you think I'm going to succeed or do you think I'm going to fail? Remember, this is really only bowlers. We've got the six giants or the seven giants. But to be honest with you, if they hit big bombs and they are like, hey, presto, they're going to get destroyed. So we're going to attack now. Here we go, guys. Let's go in for this attack. Here we go. Here we go. And we're going to drop down a bowler just on the town hall. Let's, let's just drop down. Let's drop down three bowlers. Just no, four bowlers. We're going to use four there. Just to make sure that if we do fail, then we can still get ourselves a two-star. So here we go. What side should we attack from? The queen's over here. Should we go from the queen side? It'll be a little bit more fun this way. Yep, let's do it, guys. Gonna go from the queen side. Gonna send in the king, the queen, the grand warden, and then send in those 30 bowlers. Here we go. Gonna drop in a rage spell as well. Let's go, bowlers. Let's go. Total destruction on this base. Literally gonna rip through this base. Let's see what happens. The king's already sustained a large amount of damage. Now, we do have the earthquakes and, of course, the free spells if we need them. Not going to use them just yet. We're going to keep the Inferno Tower. Sorry, not the Inferno Tower. Going to keep the Grand Warden's ability for when they reach those bloody, uh, what are they called? Those Wizard Towers. Going to drop down the free spell. Going to use the Grand Warden. Not the Grand Warden. Sorry, I keep making a mistake. Going to use the king's ability. We are not going to need the heal spell, so that's a great thing. Here we go. Grand Warden's ability just used and the Wizard Towers get ripped into pieces. And of course, those bowlers have teetotaled this base. We're already past the 69 percenter. So yeah, we didn't even need... Oh, hold on. Hold on. I forgot about the Inferno Towers. Oh, interesting. Look at that. Line of bowlers. Look at that. That is awesome. A massive line of bowlers. I want them to go towards the Inferno Tower. I think there's going to be loads of big bombs inside of here. Let's see if I'm correct. Where's the big bombs? Because we haven't triggered a single trap yet. So it's going to be interesting to see where the bombs are. Are they going to be inside of these walls here where the Inferno Towers and the Teslas? We haven't triggered any Teslas just yet. We could lose. Oh, here we go. Here we go. The traps are starting to roll in now. Loads of traps. Oh, no. Bowlers, run away. No way. We are losing troops. Wow. 
We are losing troops. Gonna drop a heal spell on those bowlers. Use the queen to take out that first inferno tower. And now we're up to 98%. Are we gonna get the victory here? That is the question. So the bowlers are going overtime. Is the queen gonna be able to target the inferno tower before she gets hit by it? Another big bomb is about to go off, but completely misses the bowlers. Are they gonna take it out? Yes. There it is, guys. Oh, 20% left. We got our second three star. So just before we end out the episode, let's check Mr. Savage. What attack strategy is he using? He's using loads of giants on this guy. Let's see if Savage is going to get the triple star here. So he's sending in a giant wizard army. Big bombs are going off though. These guys, although they're giving us the free victories, they are using some severe troll bases. And Savage's army has been ripped apart. Lucky enough for him, he had a heal spell there. But fortunately, he has also taken out every single one of the defenses. So all that's left to take out is those other structures. So shout out to this clan, guys. Shout out to Barch Wars 2. They have just basically given us a free victory and also entertained me. This has been one of the funnest things to do in such a long time. So please, guys, can we smash a 1,000 likes down below? Don't forget to stay tuned for the second episode.